You mentioned earlier that the, the ownership is very supportive of experimentation and trying new things. Uh, having 60 wine labels sort of indicates that you, you are open to trying things. Uh, talk a little bit about the spirit of experimentation. OK, and it's, it's very nice, this, uh, the, this experience for us, because um, our owner is very open-minded. Uh, I can start to work that a uh, small idea uh, and I can develop it very easy because they support with the economical situation or they support with other people that uh, help me uh, or help for our team to develop this idea. Uh, it's very easy when the, the owners maintain very healthy uh, the company and, and then uh, continues to, to run a, a lot. And talking a little bit more about exploration and, and innovation, I mean, what are some of the things that you can point to that you are excited about in terms of trying new things? I think that the most important when, is when uh, imagining the, the new trends uh, is place. It's very important, terroir. Varietals uh, adapted to this place and then I start to very open mind for the winemaking process for this terroir. Because it's, it's completely different, the winemaking process for the um, varietal range for drinks very easy or the first and second years. And it's completely different than when I go to top of the range and aging in barrels or uh, look for a specific terroir and develop this place in a very nice uh, conditions. And are there any varietals other than Malbec that you're very excited about? I mean, yes. everybody talks about Malbec, but you make 60 different wines. For, for us, Pedriel, you are in Pedriel now, is the, is the, is the, is the heart for, 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 for this Pedriel area. Norton is, is the heart. Uh, the most important uh, when beside that is Cabernet Sauvignon. This place is... Uh, is very, very spectacular, or wonderful for development Cabernet Sauvignon. Uh, and now, I start to work in a very small condition for Cabernet Franc. Uh, but in general, uh, for Cabernet Franc, it's a very small uh, um, hectare planted now, but it's a very nice uh, varietal to, to develop. Then, Petit Verdot Antanat is very nice to blending. Uh, and in white, uh, Chardonnay. Is a is a win, uh, and the second varietal for for whites is is Sauvignon Blanc. But continuous development, Bionier, Semillon, uh, Riesling, bad one. When the, I start to is, uh, speak for these uh, whites varietals, uh, in general I go to Uco Valley. Not only start to work in Uco Valley approximately three or four years ago uh, for different farmers because. And um, I think in the future, I start to, to or buy a, a small land or small vineyards in, in Uco for, for our uh, property development. But now I, I, I buy different grapes for different producers from, from Uco. Uco is a, is a, is a very high place uh, because the altitude is a lot. It's approximately three, the average is three, 3,000, 300 meters, uh, feet, uh, and for white is very nice. 